Hello everyone, I'm Marilyn from Jazz's Creation Design and I'm going to show you how to create this felt book and the miracle candle. This is a two-part video. Um, so the first thing we're going to make is a stamp. So the first page, the candle. And then on the second video, so if you do not want to make the stamp, skip this part and go check out the other video on the felt book. So to get started, you're going to need the file. So go to www.jazzycreation.com where you can find all the files that you'll need to make this project. I went ahead and used my Cricut machine to cut out the pattern. I'm using a rubber sheet that I got from Puzzle Inspiration, but I'm sure you can find um, rubber stamps at your local craft store. Once that's done, as you can see, it cut out the pattern, turned out great. So now I'm just going to remove the tape that I put on there, this painter's tape to keep it down. I'll make sure it's cut. And just like Lionel, I'm going to go ahead and remove the back. So as you can see here, I am using a piece and I'm going to go ahead and cut around the design so I can reuse the extra rubber sheet for another project. My mat is pretty dirty, but it still has that strong bond of adhesive on the mat. So I do recommend these purple cutout sheets from Cricut. Like I said, I'm just going to cut around the design, cut out, so I can use the extra for another project. So I am just removing the cut out pieces. So my settings were, um, I want to say it's poster, cut. And I went with less on the settings for a Cricut machine for those who have one. And that's it. Ran it once and it did fine. As you can see, and now I'm just putting the stamp together into an acrylic stamp block. Then I'm using Artist Free stamp ink pads. Yes, they're sublimation ink pads with beautiful colors. And so if you don't have so if you don't have the set, go get it at artistfree.com. You will find all these products that I am using. Back to the candle. I am stamping on a regular piece of paper the yellow to give it that light of the candle. And then I went ahead and did the color. And then I'm going to make sure I make it a peak test. That color looks great. And then I'm going to use the black over it so I could see the color, the yellow, and everything put together. On to felt. As you can see, I just use felt polyester. And the color is just absolutely beautiful, vibrant. Look at the rainbow butterfly. So quick recap, making our rubber stamps with our Cricut machine or any cutting machine using the settings of poster and less and it cuts through the rubber. I found this rubber piece on the Pazzle Inspiration and I am cutting it out and putting it on an acrylic block. So I've created my stamp. I am going to use Artist Free Sublimation Ink. They have a variety of colors. They have pink, yellow, purple. As you can see here, if it didn't go through, I just did the extra pieces, cleaning it off. Going to stamp the black on a separate piece of paper. 
and I'm going to use the yellow on a separate piece of paper, iron it on the felt, and then iron it on the color one, then the black one, to create the Miracle Cantle from Encanto. I hope you enjoyed this project. Hope to see you on the other video to make a felt book of Encanto theme. Happy crafting! Like for more videos!